Hey guys, welcome to my channel. I'm Divine Empress. I hope you are doing well today. I come to do our daily messages. So let's see what's going on with our daily messages. See what Spirit has to say to us today. Okay, this is the Angels and Ancestors deck. Let's just see what's going on. Let's see, flipped over. All right. Okay, let's see. Spirit, give me what I need for the collective. Okay, it says um, sage. It say be devoted and committed. So whatever you're doing, spirit wants you to be devoted and committed to it. And um, don't deviate from it right now because it's good for you. You got oracle. It say wait for important information. So spirit got some important information that they want to um, give to you. So they want you to definitely be on the lookout for that uh, information. And direction guardian, it says choose your path, okay? So I'm thinking that uh, for you to make the decision on which path or which direction you want to go right now, Spirit wants you to wait so you can um, definitely get important information from them. Okay, let me see. Let me move this back a little bit. Okay, there we go. Okay, yeah, so, all right, so let's see. What else, Spirit? Choose your path. You got to choose your path, but um, definitely wait for more information so you can make the right decision. And whatever this direction you go, just be devoted and committed to it, okay? Okay, be fearless and stand strong. Okay, so it got warrior. They want you to be fearless and stay strong. And they want you to follow the voice of your soul right now. So, yeah, pay attention to um, your intuition and what spirit is trying to um trying to tell you because it's going to lead you to happiness and you're going to have success and happiness as long as you pay attention and wait for the information for um wait for the information to come to you to choose the direction that they want you to go you got the empress okay it says uh enjoy growth and reap rewards okay all right so let's get a few more let me get, I'm going to go ahead and get these out the way. I'm just going to get a few of these. Okay, let's get, I think these are, this is the star seed. The star seed deck. So, yeah, you got the empress. You got some new beginnings, but you got to choose your path and be fearless and stay, you know, stand strong in this. Choose your path because this path is going to be great for you. It's going to be a lot of success and happiness, and you're going to reap a lot of good benefits. Give me what I need, Spirit. You just got to be devoted and committed to it because it seems like something, this is something that you've been wanting to do. What else, Spirit? It looks like it's going to be something that's going to cause you to be vulnerable. It say trust in your new path. All will work out for you. See, Spirit is confirming that, Spirit is confirming that if you go ahead and uh, once they give you the information, you can trust in your new path just as long as you be devoted and committed to it. All will work out for your benefit. That is, this is awesome. Give me a few more, Spirit. You definitely got the Empress. The Spirit wants you to let go of a fixed plan. They want you to be spontaneous. So you can definitely have room for growth. Okay, give me a few more. Give me a few more. All right. Spirit, give me a few more. Give me a few more, Spirit. Okay, I'm going I'm to go through this deck one more time. If I don't get another one, I'm, I'm just going to move on. I guess I said, I don't say what I said. <laughs> okay. It say, trust, trust what you need is there. With love, all can be accomplished. Okay? So, Spirit is saying, you know that love is here for you. And um, you can accomplish anything right now. Okay? And they say, following the path of, of another, your path is being redirected where it should be. So, Spirit is letting you know, okay, apparently you've been following, um, a following, okay, I'm, don't take this personal, but you know, sometimes we can get off our own path and start following other people because they're being, they successful in whatever they're doing, but it's not your path. Spirit is saying, walk your own journey. It's essential for you to stay on your own path because what everybody else got going on, that has nothing to do with you. And, it, it, and it's probably not even, it's, it's probably not going to even work out for your benefit the way it's working out for them. So make sure you stay on your path, okay? I know we all are searching right now and um, we can fall, you know, we can definitely fall into some 
you know, not, not, it's not a bad thing. It's just that we, Spirit wants you to just make sure you stay on your path, okay? We, we, can, we can be looking for quick fixes. Don't look for no quick fix. Just pay attention to Spirit. Pay attention to your soul because they're going to let you know which way you're supposed to go. But they want you to walk your own journey, okay? Okay, let's see. And um, Arch, um, Archangel, I'm sorry, Archangel uh, Michael. Um, they're with you right now, giving you the courage to make the life changes that will help you work on your divine life purpose. Okay, so, and you got your ancestors on, your ancestors are here as well. Okay, they're letting you know that they, they are here with you. What else, Spirit? I think it's something that, it got, it, I see this communication card. This communication card is standing out. But Spirit wants you to exercise, keep your energy up so you can definitely get divine messages. Because when you get your blood flowing and everything is good, you'll see, you know, you'll feel better. Okay? It's for spiritual growth. Okay? You're a light worker. God needs you to shine your divine light. So definitely pay attention because right now, whatever you've been, whoever you've been trying to follow, whatever you've been trying to follow is not for you. They want you to follow your own path, and you know exactly what that is. Just pay attention to your intuition and what spirit, the message of spirit trying to give you. And they say, as you honor and follow the guidance of your heart, prosperity is coming to you now. Beautiful. Okay? At the bottom of the deck, you got spend time alone in nature, meditating about your desires, intentions. Ask the angels for help and help you gain a positive perspective. Okay? All right. Let's get some major arcanas. Well, let's get a few of these first, okay? We're going all in today. Give me one more shuffle, Spirit. Yeah, you got you. You definitely, yeah, you got to figure out exactly what you want to do. If it's a place you're trying to, you think you want to move to, definitely be clear on that. Spirit will let you know where you belong. Okay, let's see. Give me what I need, Spirit. Give me what I need. Okay, Spirit is saying don't take things personal. And I don't know what this means, but it's saying you can't buy love. Okay, so, and you, you have power couple. So, you can't buy love. It is what it is. No matter how hard you want to try, you can't buy love. And don't take things personal. Okay, don't take that. Don't wear your emotions on your sleeves right now. Okay. All right, you are powerful. You're more powerful than you know. And Spirit is saying it's time for a makeover. You got to understand you do have your the, uh, the card under there telling you to exercise. Just, you know, hey, it is what it is. It say believe in yourself, okay? It say between now and six months. And they want you to get back on track with, with whatever you were doing. That's what Spirit is saying. Spirit is trying to tell you that you done got off your off your path and you follow in the path of another, okay? So these other messages that you can't buy love, that's pure and simple. You can't buy love and don't take things personal. But between now and six months, I can see happiness and joy and new beginnings in your life. That's why the Empress is here. That's why the Sun card is here. But Spirit wants you to get back on track with what you was doing and get passionate about it. That's why the uh, Sage card is here so you could be devoted and committed. And you got the Queen of Wands. The Queen of Wands is somebody that's passionate. When she does something, she's definitely passionate. She's devoted. She's committed. She's, she is of the occult too now. Okay, so you got the Hierophant. Okay, this is somebody, you got direct connection with spirit. You're definitely protected right now. You're definitely protected. Spirit is saying, you know, you're protected and to pay attention to the messages. Um, and use your wisdom with everything that you're doing. You have the will of fortune. The will of fortune is saying that if you follow your guidance and the guidance of spirit, you will definitely have fortune. You're going to definitely have a lot of fortune come into your life. And um, something might be trying to come back around. So we're going to see. But Spirit wants you to use your wisdom. Okay, you got the King of Cups. Somebody got a lot of love for you. Okay, or you got a lot of love in your heart. Okay, you're very okay, nurturing. Okay, you might not show it a lot, but you 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 are. Let's see what else. Pay attention to your emotions. All right, you got fire. You got um, you got earth, fire, water. Yeah, so pay attention to your emotions and pay attention to the to your uh your 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 passions and definitely know you're gonna you're gonna have stability. You're gonna be grounded. All right, they want you to take this leap of faith. Okay, they want you to be able to take a risk. Okay. And you got the King of Pentacles. There you go. Okay, somebody is very dedicated, loyal, stubborn. Okay, but this person also um probably will bring balance into your life and 
Spirit is saying that you've been patient. Okay, that is, this is another fire sign and you got, you got Aquarius. You're, you've been patient and your wishes will be fulfilled. That's why the star card is here. And you got the sun. Boom, there you go. <laughs> Happiness and joy. You don't wait it for, you don't wait it for this for a minute. You don't wait it for, for, for this, um, for your wishes to be, be fulfilled and you've been patient. That's why the temperance card is here. But baby, you got passion. You got stability. You got money. You got uh, new beginnings. You got the sun. This is happiness. This is joy. Okay. You got the sun card twice. Okay, so definitely pay attention to spirit. They're trying to let you know that you are you are definitely on the right path. And they, if you're not on the right path, pay attention. They're going to put you back on the right path so you can make sure that you uh, be successful in everything you do. I love you guys and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.